Do some whales have legs? Find out next on today's Creation Moment. And now, here's our Creation Moments host, Ian Taylor. Whales pose some interesting problems for those who believe that all living things evolved slowly to their present forms over millions of years. According to evolution, sea creatures gradually adapted to life on land because they could make a better living there. That's where mammals supposedly evolved. Then, for some unknown reason, some of the mammals, Darwin said it was the bear, decided to return to the sea. This required that the mammal ancestors of the whales lose their legs, readapt to locomotion in water, develop new vision abilities, and move its breathing nostrils to behind its brain. As unlikely as all this sounds, some evolutionists make one more amazing claim. They claim that some whales still have the vestigial organs of their pelvis or legs embedded in their bodies. Some have even claimed that certain whales have been seen that still had the vestigial legs growing out of their bodies. However, no trace of these so-called legs can be found in any of the scientific literature. The small bone that some whales have is not a vestigial pelvis. It is not even attached to the backbone or any other part of the skeleton, but is situated within the body as an anchor for some of the whale's organs. In short, any talk of whales with legs or vestigial walking structures is just pure myth. God created the whales as the Bible says. The great whales glorify God with their great majesty and power. To purchase a copy of Ian Taylor's book, In the Minds of Men, call us toll-free at 800-42-BIBLE. That's 800-422-4253. Or visit us online at creationmoments.com. And join us again for another Creation Moment, proclaiming evidence of God's truth.